In Nigeria, drones have gained popularity for event coverage and capturing breathtaking aerial views for films. However, Zipline Nigeria has recently elevated the logistics landscape by introducing drone deliveries with a primary focus on healthcare. This innovative approach aims to ensure that even the most remote and challenging to access areas receive crucial medical supplies. A lot of impact stories that have proven that this technology is here to stay. Why am I saying this? We've had a woman who was in labor in one of the um, hard to reach areas where we deliver healthcare commodities. And it was difficult to get oxytocin for her to ensure that uh, she delivered safely because they needed to induce the labor. And it took just about 10 minutes. For, our, for them, they called us for, the, uh, for this uh, medication and it took us just 10 minutes to deliver to this woman. And a life was saved. Two lives, if you like, because the woman and, uh, and, the, and the baby. So this is the, the life-changing uh, uh, it's a life-changing technology, actually, and that's what we have been doing in all the areas, in the three states we have been operating from in Nigeria, and that is Kaduna, Cross River, and Bayesa. So we deliver commodities to the hard-to-reach areas, areas where you get uh, to go traditionally by road, seven hours, it takes our drones 45 minutes to get there. And for those that are really very bad terrain, where you can't even assess by road, we can go there easily for, on behalf of uh, the government and even private partnership that we are also going to uh, explore. Presently, delivery services in the country face limitations relying on dispatch rides, e-hailing cabs and interstate buses, which are often affected by weather conditions, accidents, traffic congestion and various official and unofficial fees. The drone technology can go at any, at any uh, given time. With whether, whatever the weather is and whatever the terrain is, it can go over mountains, it can go over a uh, 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 riverine area, that's exactly what we are doing in Cross um, Bayesa. It can go whatever weather we, it encounters, it can actually fly in those weathers. Things that can actually disrupt the regular or the traditional transport method, the drone is able to overcome that. And we've done an impact study in one of our state, uh, countries we operate from in Ghana. Ghana, uh, we currently, we've been in Ghana since 2019. Uh, and uh, when we did that impact study, the traditional method versus the drone technology, it was discovered that the drone technology is 80% cheaper than the traditional method of deliveries. We are currently going to do that same impact study in Nigeria. We just started, we are just uh, a year old in Nigeria for operation wise. Uh, and we're going to do that and also come up with uh, uh, the results of uh, the study. But that's what uh, we have done in Ghana, the study. Mm. Has Zipline expanded operations across three states in Nigeria? There is hope that this technology combined with public and private partnership will not only enhance logistics and healthcare industry, but also create a surge in demand for skilled professionals in Nigeria.